Man, listen, bro. I don't know how many times. Listen, Tyrese be doing this stuff to himself. I don't know what to say, bro. If your woman disrespects you like this, this man was on IG Live with this girl. Blatant out disrespect. Now, Tyrese done posted some other stuff going live. And I don't know why he be doing this to himself. But, hey, this is some stuff, fellas, where you need to pay attention to. Watch this whole video, man. Because I'm going to show you what he was saying about this chick before and after. Now that he realized that she's blatantly disrespectful. Don't ever let your woman do you like this, man. Real quick, before we hop into this, y'all follow me on IG. Turn on notifications, bro. Like it up. Comment. Share this bit. All the good stuff, bro. Watch this. I looked at it and I said, God sent me this woman because I'm laughing. I'm flirting. I got butterflies in my stomach. I'm in love with this woman. <laughs> yeah. All right. So that's the most commonly asked question. How do we meet? Mm -hmm. I slid in the DMs. Yeah. We linked up. He wasn't my type at all. We my linked. type was actually Paul Walker recipes. <laughs> but I... <laughs> He wasn't my type at all. And my type don't, is not white. I'm just saying I was more interested don't in touch me. Paul and every don't, fast and furious. Don't touch me. Um, and even when I met him, I was like, uh, don't, don't he's kind of old. Uh, I just like his smile. It's pretty cool. This, um, this one, this one his really personality, bad. His personality, his personality was... This just went really bad, really fast. His personality was okay, but he I'm getting off live. He didn't understand the Instagram model um, thing, so he would always talk down So you Instagram wanted the homie, models. you didn't want me. Now check this out, bro, check this out. This is why you never go into the extra validation for your chick. You see how he was talking about her before. This is, right, these are the butterflies you have the honeymoon phase. Guys, you cannot be acting brand new to this stuff. Women to sit there and, and coast on a whole relationship based off of the beginning and how they felt. This is why as time goes on and you get past that six month year honeymoon phase where you've never argued and she ain't acting out of pocket. She ain't doing nothing disrespectful to you. She ain't trying you where you got to check her all the time. Let that period of time pass by. If you not the same dude from day one, whole different woman you're going to be dealing with. She will be trying you, my brother. Blatantly sometimes, sometimes on purpose. And guess what it's up to you to do? Check her. You got to check that broad. Now, this boy was simping so hard. Tyrese was simping. So I don't know why. I think he just started to believe his own R&B songs from the early 2000s. I don't know what he doing. He need to go back to Jody and Baby Boy and how he was treating them, right? Because all that other stuff ain't working, fellas. That stuff don't work. Over-validating a chick when she hasn't earned it, she doesn't deserve it, making her feel like she the greatest thing since sliced bread. He done put that pussy on a pedestal if there was a pedestal to be put on. You know what I'm saying, guys? Never lead with this stuff. Never lead with that. In the interview before, he done made it seem like one drop from them guts would just lube up all them rusty ass hinges on your motherfucking door. Bruh, chill out. Chill out. And I know she had that on playback. She knew she had him in there. Guys, this is why you don't boost that ego. I don't know what y'all doing when y'all leave with all this validation and extra stuff. Bro, just because I'm saying that don't mean I'm telling you to be a straight up asshole. That's not what I'm saying. They gotta earn it though. If if they're not working for it, they're not going to appreciate it. They're not going to respect you. That's the whole point of this stuff, man. Fuck the love, bro. You need to have your respect. I'll be damned. And then they on IG live and she clowning this man in his face behind this man, grabbing on this man, laughing. Yeah, he old too. And I was actually, I actually was feeling Paul Walker, RIP. I was actually feeling Paul Walker and I he wasn't really my type and this and that clown of you on IG Live and he still stayed on it. Let her talk her shit continuously. Fellas, I hate to see I hate to see I hate to see guys lose like this, man. I really I mean somebody gotta lose, right? But at least I can bring it to y'all and be like, okay, learn from this, learn from this. Because this man Tyrese done, I mean, he done put himself out there a few times. Like you never allow a chick to disrespect you like that, especially on IG Live. Fellas, that when you get it with your chick, right? This is how you avoid this kind of stuff, right? 
this is the best thing you can do when you get with a girl and you start to lead into exclusivity if you decide to if you decide that okay i'm grooming this girl to be my main chick you got some side pieces or whatever the case is first thing she gonna try to say is well you need to get rid of them side pieces fellas don't get rid of them make sure she ain't watching this dead either but don't get rid of them don't get rid of your side pieces that's gonna keep you in line that's for you that's so you don't get pussy trapped get weak to the coochie that's for you brother that's for you it's not about her it's also about her because as long as you a strong man she'll continue to follow you and she won't act out of her ego and start trying you like tyrese just got tried on ig live so that's number one don't get rid of the side pieces number two make sure that you keep a confidential relationship you do not need to be going live with your girl you do not need to be posting your chick all over your social media page do she even post you i'll be talking to guys and you know consultations and stuff and, and guys hit me up on the con like if y'all need advice bro i come up with game plans with guys right solid game plans if there's any kind of advice you need book a consultation with me look at the link in the description or you might need my programs seduction you're trying to get your riz game up that's seduction get the programs dog check them out legit stuff all right i digress keep your shit private i don't talk to one dude man he over here like yeah man you know he's mentioning her and all this stuff and how they starting a relationship and stuff i'm looking at his page he got pictures with her all the hearts all the in the purple heart too this nigga didn't even put a red it's a purple one that's how you know this man was in it deep in it deep but his girl his girl nothing he's not on her page he's not featured on her no pictures nothing no pictures nothing keep your relationship private so she don't get too much of an ego boost right the fact that she's with you or see see guys when, when you're of a higher status all they want to do is eat up all the attention that you get they just want to be a part of that to feed more of their ego they need the attention boost they want the validation and all this is doing is setting up a time for her to disrespect you again at a later time right to disrespect you at a later time in my opinion because you feeding her all this validation and she hasn't earned it you feeding her all this attention and she hasn't earned it she is going to disrespect you it's it, it's not a two-way street for us fellas y'all got to stop looking at this the way the girls look at it you got to look at it from our standpoint you be trying to leave with all this fairy tale princess lovey dovey shit like you just supposed to be falling in love with your soulmate and see that's what women ask me well where's my soulmate well bitch you 45 you probably already met him and you lost right that's what i'm gonna tell her but that's okay because they look out for that be a guy same age talking about some well i'm just looking for my soul well i'd be looking at you stupid like what are you talking about you sound like a female you should be trying to have a woman respect you. Get the respect, she gets the love. You want the respect, not the love. That's how you prevent disrespect. The best way you can. The best way you can. At damn show least, you're not going to be like Tyrese on IG Live and a female trying you, a younger one at that, and you an established man, a very successful man, and you done simped and validated so much and have been on previous ig lives where you've done the same thing and then bulge your eyes out and all this other shit crying of course she gonna try you of course call this man out of his name tried this man tried this man live didn't give a damn still had a smile on her face laughing it off like it's a joke if a female is disrespecting you she sees you as a joke she sees you as a joke that's the last thing i want to see the last thing i want to see is the fellas who watch my content and they out here really putting in work day in, day out, day in, day out. The only one that can really appreciate that is your fellow brothers that are doing the same thing. A woman can't appreciate that because she doesn't live the same life as you. She lives life on easy mode compared to a man. We have to become something. So you mean to tell me you put in all this work to become successful just so you can hop on IG Live and get disrespected? in front of everybody now you viral for that 
That's wild, bro. That's wild. I can't stand to see my brothers getting disrespected. Fellas, keep your relations with these females private and make sure you seek respect, not love, respect, so you don't get disrespected. And if she tries that disrespectful stuff, check it and or leave it at the door. So that means you got to chuck those deuces in case she want to try it again. Because this ain't baseball. We ain't going strike one, strike two, strike. No, bitch, you just going to be out of here.